Well, hello there everybody, it's Sally here with a very quick Tuesday teaching tip today. And I don't know whether you can see from your angle, but I'm, so, I'm here surrounded by tissues, okay, tissues. I've got my hand gel, I've got my um, biodegradable wipes here. I've got a plastic bag to put the tissues in when they've been used. I've also got a, an e-cloth, a microfiber e-cloth. And of course, what I'm talking about here is the um, coronavirus and how we can look after ourselves. And I've just finished writing a blog, which I might just about get out before I start teaching. I'm not sure, but it'll certainly be out later on this evening with just a few tips and hints of things I've been doing. Um, I've been contacting my parents, for example, and just letting them know and asking everybody to wash their hands when they arrive. And um, of course, to wash their hands, I'm encouraging everybody to sing happy birthday. And it's that I'm going to talk about in a moment. But um, just to take you through a few other things, I've got this microfiber e-cloth, which I'm using to wipe down the keys. I just damp this and then I wipe down the keys between each pupil. And then at the end of the day, I'm, I'm wiping it much more thoroughly with some anti-virus uh, stuff and also wiping down the piano stool. Um, I've got a government notice on my door because I am an educational establishment when I'm teaching. I've also got a, around my wash basin a little wash your hands thing for children, little illustration. And I've also got, because I thought let's make this fun because we've got to keep the kids light about this. They've got to know it's serious but we can't be heavy with them. You know, we've, we've got to actually engage them in this whole process. So I have written out happy birthday twice. Because, of course, that's what we're all supposed to sing. Here in the UK, what we've been all told to sing is happy birthday twice and wash our hands whilst we do it. So I've asked them to sing this. And that is, as I say, just there in front of them. And um, and then at the bottom, though, I have asked some questions because I thought, well, let's keep this. Let's keep this educational. Let's keep this piano based. So at the bottom, it says, um, come and tell me something you noticed about the music. So, for example, the name of the first note, the name of the last note, the number of beats in the bar, the, uh, the key signature. I'm, I'm not expecting them to do all of them. I just want them to choose one thing to come and tell me. You know, how many minims or half notes are there? How many phrases are there? Are there any repeated patterns? And of course, you know, I got this with my students yesterday and it brings out lots of interesting conversations like, well, what note does it start on? And they went C. And what note did it finish on? Well, it finishes on F. Hmm. You know, and for those that know things like key signatures, well, what's the key signature? And then that brings around this whole thing about um, happy birthday starts on the dominant and then it ends on the tonic. So it's, I'm using it as a little educational opportunity to get them all to really learn how to play um, happy birthday. And it's just a bit of fun and it does make them think about hand washing. So I've been standing there with them, you know, doing all this business and going up here like we're all being told to at the moment. And then next week, of course, we've got to continue. It won't just go away. We've got to continue. And uh, next week, I shall put up a slightly different version. It could be in a different key or it might have um, a different... Um, uh, I might miss out the phrases or I might miss out the odd note. I'm going to keep changing it or I might even do a different clef. I might do it in the bass clef rather than the treble clef or something like that. So just something to keep that hand washing really in the forefront of people's minds, but also to help people realise that um, this is important, but we can bring it back to a musical point here. So that was my top tip for today. Happy birthday with some hand washing and give them the music so that they can look at it. So I've laminated it. And as I say, it's just in front of my wash basin. You're going to be able to download that copy that I've just showed you there in the blog that I'm currently writing might not get it out in the next hour when I start teaching. So if it's not out by half past two, it'll be out later on this evening. And um, you can download it. Do feel free just to take that idea and, and use it. Let, let's just keep it nice and light for the kids. But do look after yourselves wherever you are. Um, and as I say, there is uh, in the blog, there will be some also some some ideas for what you can say to parents and look after yourself. Right. Enough from me. Um, take care. Happy teaching wherever you are. Thanks for watching. Thanks, Sharon. Bye-bye.